If Adam is listening, when you start composing a song, do you hear a melody in your head or do you start with a key first? Is there an instrument you always choose to compose on or do you pick a different one depending on what you have in mind? Um, not really. <laughs> I think uh, the process of writing and composing for television is really different in that you have to write about 40 minutes of music, sometimes in as short as three and a half or four days. So a lot has to get done very quickly. So you're relying on an, an innate intuition and an instinct more than inspiration and a concept. A, inspiration is kind of a luxury that you have to uh, take it as it comes. There are things that can sort of stoke it, um, but I think most importantly, working around the concept that you develop is what helps you stay focused and efficient. So at the beginning of a series, you develop the sound and the instruments and the ideas that you're gonna use, and that's a, a little bit of an exploration process and then the rest of it is just appropriate execution and seeking inspiration from what the picture is doing and what the 300 other creative people have done before me, be it the writers, the costume designers, the lighting technicians, the actors and actresses. It's all, it's all kind of there, so that kind of did... I, I can't really sum that up. I mean, in short, I would say that the concept is most important and that's kind of the starting point.